determinant means something that determines. In mathematical language, determinant denotes the volume enclosed by the rows of a matrix. The determinant of a matrix M is denoted by two straight lines or DET of M. Determinant of a matrix may be graphically represented by finding out the volume enclosed by the matrix and it requires the use of vectors. For knowledge of vectors, please refer to the module on matrix algebra and linear models. The matrix M is a collection of two row vectors, 1, 0 and 0, 1. Each row has a single dimension, a displacement from 1 to 0 and a displacement from 0 to 1. Graphically, these vectors may be drawn in a two-dimensional space. The area enclosed by the two vectors 0, 1 and 1, 0 may graphically be calculated by drawing two lines, one parallel to the x-axis from point 1 on the y-axis and another parallel to the y-axis from point 1 on the x-axis. The area is calculated by using the formula for the area of a square. This gives the determinant as 1. Mathematically, determinant may be found by the method of cross multiplication. Take another example. What is the determinant of this matrix? Let us first draw the vectors in the two-dimensional space. In order to find the determinant, we calculate the area of the large rectangle and then subtract the sum of the area of the small rectangles and triangles from the area of the large rectangle. This gives us 12 minus 10 is equal to 2. Now, mathematically, the determinant is calculated by the method of cross multiplication and gives us 2 into 2 minus 2 into 1 that is equal to 2. It must be noted that determinant is a scalar quantity and determinants can be calculated only for square matrices. Another important concept in matrix algebra is the rank of a matrix. The rank of a matrix may be defined as the total number of linearly independent rows or columns in a matrix. If the vectors are dependent on some other vector, they are said to be linearly dependent. Otherwise, they are linearly independent. The two column vectors C1 equal to 5, 10 and C2 equal to 25, 50 are linearly dependent because C2 is 5 times of C1. The rank of a matrix may be calculated by finding a non-zero determinant. The maximum order of a non-zero determinant gives the rank of the matrix. For the 2 by 2 matrix V, the determinant of V is equal to 6 minus 2 is equal to 4 that is not equal to 0. Therefore, rank is equal to the order of the matrix and that is 2. If a 3 by 3 matrix has a non-zero determinant, the rank is 3. But if the determinant of a 3 by 3 matrix is 0, we find all the possible 2 by 2 matrices 
and if the determinant of any 2 by 2 matrix is non zero the rank of the matrix is 2 